In this video, we'll talk about control room. As you know, Process Studio is used to build and run the process in the development environment. Here in the studio, you can create a process and you can debug or you can run the process from this Process Studio. But Process Studio is only used for the development purpose or for the testing purpose. Process Studio is not used to run the process in the production environment. To run the process in the production environment, you can use Control Room. Control Room is the location where you can execute, schedule, monitor and manage process queues and digital workers. This is the screenshot of that control room. I will show you that also. This control room has four sections. One, that it has all the options for the session management, queue management, schedule. Second, that is available process where we can see all the process that is published to the control room. Third, we have resources. Resources means all the digital workers, your computers which is like a uh, robots and the fourth one so this is the environments where you can see all the sessions sessions means whatever running process completed process all the sessions you will be getting here let me open blue prism here to go to the control room you can find out the third tab next to the studio this is the control you can also go and click on this control and then you will see this page here left side we are getting all the control option here we can manage the sessions it means we can view the sessions based on the filters we can filter out all the running sessions we need to see here all the stopped one terminated today's session last 15 minutes sessions we can view all this process from here running process stop process we have the queue management options so from here currently there is one queue that is by default that that was created but i used uh, last time so this is the queue here we have the queue option that is we can see here and whatever items you will be adding to the queue you will see here in this queue contents now here we have a scheduler so you can create a schedule and you can run your process on the specific date and time now right side you will see here this is the resources panel where you can find all the resources if you have mapped in this account so currently this is my machine name so the your machine name is the resources your machine name is the digital workers here and here in the bottom we can see all the environments all the running and completed or terminated or failed sessions here so in the next video we'll discuss about how to publish process to control room